Bud Light Seltzer. YouTube, welcome to the channel. My name is Jason. If you're new here, please hit that subscribe button. Here on this channel, I do a lot of food and product reviews. Today, we're checking out the new Bud Light Seltzer. So I have the variety pack here. It comes with 12, 12 ounce cans, four different flavors. We have black cherry, lemon lime, strawberry, and mango. Um, they, uh, they contain 5% alcohol per can, one gram of sugars, and 100 calories per can. So if you've seen the commercial, you know they say if you're not a fan of Bud Light, don't worry, you'll still like these because there is absolutely no Bud Light in these. It's just made by Anheuser-Busch, so that's why it has the Bud Light name on it. On the back here, it says, looking for answers. What does it taste like? Seltzer. Does it taste like seltzer or beer? Seltzer. Is there any Bud Light in it? No. But can I drink it when I typically drink Bud Light? Yes. At, and then it gives a latitude and longitude here, and you can look this up, at 40.696252 dash 76.235543. Wherever that is, it says, if you do, take a picture. So maybe look that up and see where that location is. Is it gluten-free? Yes. Also, what's a gluten? Good question. If you know the answer, let me know in the comments below. What's a gluten? Is it for non-beer people? Yes. Again, like they said, there's no Bud Light in this. Is it only for non-beer people? No. With all these flavors, should I go in, should I go in any specific order? Nope, you do you. How many should I buy? How many can you carry? Does it turn my beer fridge into a seltzer fridge? That's a true philosophical quandary. Is it still okay to say dilly dilly? We'll get back to you on that. So questions and answers on the back, questions that people probably have, answers from Bud Light. I don't know, you probably still say dilly dilly. Does anybody say dilly dilly other than in the commercial? Do you say dilly dilly? Do your friends say dilly dilly at a bar? I hope not. So again, 12 cans in here. And this, I live here in Michigan, so we also have you know, 10 cent uh, deposit, you have to pay on these for refundable. So it was like 14, 1460 or something for a four, for a 12 pack, plus then you pay the $1.20 deposit on it. So let's open this up. So let's get one of each of these out. So there we go, we got one of each here. I have black cherry, mango, strawberry, and lemon lime. Let's take a look at the cans. Bud Light Seltzer, 5%, 100 calories. Light Simple, black cherry. So I guess we just go in order and try them. FYI, I'm a beer drinker. Um, I haven't had a hard seltzer, so I'm learning as we go. We'll see if this is anything good. Being a beer drinker, is this something I'd ever get? Again, I'm making a face because obviously in my mind, I'm thinking I'm gonna be drinking a beer. So it's that initial taste of, oh wait, we're not in beer country. This isn't beer. Black cherry, I mean. And I believe these are all clear. Let's see, yeah. It's I'm, I'll save the final thoughts on these till the end. Black cherry. Has a decent black cherry taste. So this is mango. I can definitely a mango smell. As I'm spilling it all over the front of me. Black 
Mango, definitely a mango taste. I'm liking this better than the black cherry. So, so far, and I'm gonna, we'll rank them from best to worst over here. So, where's the flavors? So I'll put mango there. I think mango is definitely better than the black cherry. Strawberry. Enough said. Strawberry. Again, it's just, you know, it's not that it doesn't taste like strawberry. It does. It's just... I guess maybe you have to be like a wine cooler or maybe you enjoy seltzers. Then you'd like these. Not bad. Lemon lime. That one's my favorite. Least favorite. These two. I could drink these two, eh, I don't know. I'm, again, I'm just, the strawberry and, and the black cherry, not saying they're bad and they don't taste like it. To me, it's just, I don't wanna drink that. Um, gosh, what are my thoughts on these? <laughs> Flavor-wise, it's, it's there. Again, I just don't wanna drink a, you know, if I'm, I don't wanna drink a strawberry flavored, it's almost like seltzer water. Strawberry seltzer water. And yes, they have 5% alcohol in there, so you're getting a little buzz from them, a little. But if, if I was to drink them again, I'd go with these two. But if you're not a seltzer drinker and you're just like a beer drinker and you're like, oh, I see these from Bud Light. I wonder what these would be like. Being a beer drinker as I am, I'm not going to, I'm going to find someone else that drank these. I'm not going to finish these. I'm not a fan of hard seltzers. I'm just trying to think, um, I guess if you're not a beer fan and you want to be at a bar and you want to drink something out of a can that Looks like a beer. I don't know. I'm just trying to think who drinks these. Let me know in the comments. Are you a fan of these and why? And it's not, I'm not trying to be mean or anything uh, and say, no, you're, you're silly for drinking a seltzer. I'm just wondering why, you know, what's, what do you like about the seltzer compared to say a beer or, you know, you know, something stronger, a, a mixed drink or something, or a, a Mike's hard lemonade. You know, what, what do you like about the seltzers over, over those? You know, if I'm not gonna, if I'm gonna drink something that's not a beer, I'm probably gonna go with like a Mike's or Mike's Harder. I, I think I like the flavors of those better than these. I'm just, yeah, the seltzer is just a little odd to me. Um, hmm. I just don't know what my thoughts are on these because again, I can't give you, you know, like Because I'm not a seltzer drinker. So I can't really tell you. I mean the flavors are there lemon lime mango black cherry Strawberry they taste like that if that's what you're into um, At my store where I got these you could only get them in that variety pack So I don't know if they're gonna sell these individually if you can just get a packet of just the lemon lime just the mango We'll have to see in the future how they do that. It probably depends on how well these sell. Um, let me know in the comments below, have you tried them? What's your favorite flavor here? And did you really like them or, you know what would be cool with these? I don't know if you can see the tops there. Even the little tabs, yeah, green, orange, a purplish, a red. My kids back in the day used to make the little bracelets out of the the tabs, those would be great because they're colored. So if your kids make tabs or make the bracelets out of these uh, pop tabs, there you go. You got plenty of colors if you buy and drink these. But I'm gonna, I don't wanna give it a thumbs down because it's not that these are horrible. I'm just not a big fan of seltzers. So I guess it's a decent drink. 
Um, this one, like I said, the, this is, let me try the mango again. I think I could do those if, you know, if some of them, that's some party or something, that's all they had, I would go with those ones, but um, I'm not gonna go out of my way if I'm somewhere drinking at a bar or something and order these. And I'm probably not gonna I know that I'm not gonna buy these again. Maybe someone else here will get these, but they're, they're, they're okay. I'm just not a big fan of them. Let me know in the comments below, what do you think of them? So guys, like I said at the beginning, if you're new here, please hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell notification so you're notified every time I upload a new video. And I will see you guys next time. I need to find someone to finish these. I don't want to waste these four.